We first identified um, back in 2014, following the Now or Never report, Shaping Pharmacy for the Future, that there was a real need for pharmacists to be involved in the care of patients in care homes. So since that time, we've been running a number of campaigns and we're now launched back in February this year, the campaign around pharmacists in, in providing care in care homes. So what we have produced is a policy paper that identifies the particular areas where pharmacists can make a difference. And what we're asking for is that all care homes should have a pharmacist who is responsible for medicines and their use within care homes, but as part of a multidisciplinary team, so they're not just working on their own. And following that, we held a summit in December last year and we produced a report from that called The Right Medicine, which we published in February this year. And that again talks about the various different things that pharmacists can do to improve patient care in care homes. And we are holding a round table in July to look at with, with key stakeholders, so care providers, regulators, patient groups, to look at what can pharmacists actually do and how can we then take this forward and actually implement it um, in care homes. And also we're working very closely with NHS England and the use of the Pharmacy Integration Fund to see how perhaps some of that can be used to, to help and support pharmacists in care homes.